The main goal of this protocol is to design and synthesize dual modal nanosensors capable of detecting bacterial contaminants such as E. coli 0157H7. Magnetofluorescent nanosensors are synthesized by functionalizing iron oxide nanoparticles via a two step procedure. First, targeting antibodies are conjugated to the surface of the nanoparticle. Then, fluorescent dye is loaded into its coating. The pairing of these modalities allows for rapid and sensitive detection of bacterial contaminants in both low and highly concentrated solutions. In the presence of a small amount of bacteria, the nanosensors will swarm around the bacteria due to the targeting of the conjugated antibodies. This swarming alters the interactions of the nanosensor's magnetic core with the surrounding water protons, allowing for sensitive detection of changes in magnetic relaxation values. As the concentration of bacterial contaminants in solution increases, swarming decreases, and the magnetic modality's ability to quantify contamination is reduced. However, as the bacterial concentration increases, so does the fluorescence emission of the bound nanosensors. It is for this reason that the pairing of magnetic and fluorescent modalities is important. The combination has allowed for the detection of as little as one colony forming unit of E. coli 0157H7 within minutes. The first step in the synthesis of magnetofluorescent nanosensors is the preparation of an iron salt solution consisting of both ferrous and ferric chloride. The iron will provide the nanosensors with a magnetic core which allows for its adaptability to magnetic relaxation platforms. Additional solutions needed are polyacrylic acid and ammonium hydroxide. Hydrochloric acid is introduced to the iron salt solution which is then added to the ammonium hydroxide solution while vortexing. Finally, the polyacrylic acid solution is added and the resulting mixture is vortexed for an additional hour while the reaction continues.